Time to make a mission. So today we are doing an outing to a place called Silver Orange Bistro. I'm excited. It's Orange Farms and hopefully it's going to be a good day. Found an orange. <laughs> I think we found the place. Um, it's down there. However, I think we should take the car because it looks a bit of a long walk. <laughs> apologize for the noise there's quite a few busy tables around us but uh, silver orange while well, we're in a place called almost orange and hard appear sport dam it is don't worry you don't want. Okay, like she it. doesn't know what to do with herself she's like what I do but um so we're in a lovely place called it's an orange orchid not an orange vineyard thanks to the English fundi obviously now we find ourselves having a lovely little light lunch outside here on the river end with the orange orchid behind us and I think it's going to be a lovely afternoon it's a lovely place called silver orange and almost orange I don't know how to and we're in the middle of winter Delicious. The food has arrived and it is unreal. Already started. And Michaela has not wasted any time and started already. Sorry, I'm out of time. There we go. So let's talk micro travel. Now you ask what is micro travel? Well to me it is kind of exploring where you are, where you live every day, just going on small little adventures and enjoying yourself, kind of acting. I'm sure I've spoken in previous videos where you kind of act as a tourist in your own city. And what I mean by that is like you don't have to live this eight to five and then like there's so many great things to see in your in your actual city where you should actually go and explore i mean if a tourist came to your city they would see all these great things but yet that you live there you don't really do anything so you kind of adapt that tourist mindset but in where you live just to make it a bit more interesting and more fun <laughs> So Michaela and myself do this on a regular basis while we try and do it as often as we can because it makes us feel that we are doing things instead of just working the, the 9 to 5 every single day. Um, but there's just so many places to see. Just go online, Google things to do, tourist things to do, go to TripAdvisor and you'll be amazed at the amount of things that you can actually do in your own city that'll make you feel a bit more alive as opposed to going on these massive holidays you sometimes don't have the opportunity to go on holiday every single weekend so this is kind of the next best thing as opposed to just going to the bar going to Bry's and that is actually not what um, I'm into as well as Michaela is that we want to do more exploratory things instead of doing the same things every single day and every single weekend <music> So at the end of this, I encourage everyone to, to travel more, well to micro travel more. See your city through a different lens, see your city as a tourist as opposed to someone living there. And a great place to start 
is this lovely little place just outside in Hardy, 60 k's away and it is you feel like you're probably down in the western cape it is stunning the buildings are stunning the food is great the vibe is nice and it's a good starting place for you to go i want to know if you can help my husband he has this terrible dream part of traveling with michaela is that we need ice cream stops ice cream stops so oh. despite our amazing day we need an ice cream stop <laughs> yeah. ice creams are important we're not um winning yet we're still mm. looking for an ice cream we're still winning we will we're still looking sorry <laughs> time where he's running running mm -hmm. matt i don't know how this works <laughs> oh wait michaela has got her ice cream oh and she is trying to figure out how to use her ice cream though. <laughs> it's a bit problematic He's running, but he's not getting any. We are happiness now. Is. Happiness is Michaela right now. Yes. Mission accomplished. I did want a normal soft serve ice cream, but they're not working today. No. And now we find ourselves staring at some pigeons enjoying our ice cream. Or her ice cream. <laughs> pigeons. Very interesting. Where? <laughs> 